Hi, I'm Alana. Hi, and I'm Jared. Welcome to the Nightly News Remote Learning Edition. As Rome schools prepare for reopening in a hybrid model next week, Superintendent Mr. Blake will be hosting two community forums via Zoom, similar to those held in August. One is Wednesday, October 21st at 6 p.m., and the other is Friday, October 23rd at 10 a.m. The links to join can be found at the district website. With the election only weeks away, Kennedy shares more from Civics 101 with Mr. Dunn. Seem to think that since they're in a position you could call privilege, that the outcome of this upcoming election won't really affect them. What do you have to say to this? I think that uh, what happens to your generation uh, in the future is going to be decided by the votes we have today. Again, uh, policies and laws are going to change, and um, uh, you know your future will be directly impacted whether it's uh, student loans for college, or whether it's um, uh, social security for grandma and grandpa, um, all these things will have important impacts uh, on, on this year's election, on, on the national stage, and then locally uh, important decisions about taxes for schools and for roads and for different programs in the city uh, and our county are gonna be decided. Uh, and it'll be for years to come. and. Uh, Whichever way they're decided, it'll take a lot to change them back, the, you know, to a different way in the future. So, uh, you know, uh, I, uh, I'm i a big believer that, you know, if you don't take part in the process, you have no right to complain about the decisions, you know, uh, that affect you. So um, I think uh, the future depends on what we decide today. All right. There's a lot of people who don't really have time to register. I think that it's too time consuming. Do you think that's true in a sense, the registration, or do you think it's just easy? It's worth the time. Well, they're trying harder and harder in new ways, and it's a little controversial, but they're trying to offer more options for people to um, to vote. Um, typically speaking, registering around here is not so difficult, but in some of the bigger cities, it's been an issue. And now they're trying mail-in voting, which is um, probably a good idea if it's done right, and probably not such a good idea if it's not done right. But um, they're going to try new things, and um, hopefully there'll be good things for more people expressing their rights as citizens and voters. And that's always a good thing. So I applaud them for trying, and I hope it comes off right. But um, um Again, uh, we, we want um, citizens to vote, and it's important to, as an American that as many of us take part in it as possible. Thank you, Kennedy. And remember, your vote is your voice. As Mr. Dunn said, keep your fingers crossed for America. Now to the sports desk for an update from K&K Sports Talk. The Rome Free Academy boys varsity soccer team kicked off their season on Tuesday afternoon against Westboro. Unfortunately, Westboro boys soccer won in a shutout over RFA. The RFA girls soccer team christened the new turf Tuesday afternoon and pulled out a 2-1 win against Whitesboro, with Grace Engelber and Lauren Dor Dorfman both scoring goals. Sophomore Miranda McCormick had 14 saves in the game. RFA field hockey won 2-1 in overtime Wednesday night against Camden. Emma Wright scored the first goal. Maggie Kozinski scored the game-winning goal. RFA Tennis lost in a doubleheader against Camden Wednesday night. Taylor Frost and Abigail Call won both of their matches. In cross-country news, the boys' team defeated New Hartford last weekend, and the girls' team tied with New Hartford. However, the Spartans unfortunately won the tiebreaker. The next meet is scheduled for tomorrow. Next week is National Health Education Week. Tune in for some ideas on how to stay fit from home. Here at the Nightly News, we are starting a new segment called Words of Wisdom from RFA Alumni. If you are RFA alumni and want to be interviewed, please email us at rfanighttimes19 at gmail.com. Remember, RFA, take charge and show some RFA pride. We're all, We're in, this all in this together. <laughs>